I'm nasty. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Not so slow. No. I was looking for affection, so I decided. Thank you for joining us in the Hennessy Zone. Straight talk, no chaser. This place was created for those topics that require, well, something a little stronger than just champagne. Over here, we think and drink responsibly. We gotta let them know. The classy drink Hennessy, too. <laughs> Now, we don't solve cases over here, but we do give our opinions on them for the people under the stairs. So grab your glass, scoot up, and let's henna see what's on the docket for today. Now take those glasses and raise them in the air. Let's toast. So today, we embrace the power of owning our story, our struggle, and our triumph. The good, the bad, and the ugly. Here's to taking control, standing firm, and owning every part of who we are. Raise your glass high to owning our strength, our truth, and our journey. Cheers to living boldly and unapologetically. Cheers to owning it. Hennessy, let's toast. So here's the story, right? Apparently, this mother went to her child's school for a spelling bee and she was intoxicated. During the spelling bee, she became disorderly in conduct, began acting out, I'm guessing, and showing her complete ass. And the police were called. This is why I keep saying, y'all gotta be careful who y'all procreating with. Now, I don't have a problem with anybody having anything to drink, but going to your child's school drunk, when it's supposed to be about celebrating and supporting your child, is absolutely despicable and deplorable. Damn diabolical if you ask me. So you mean to tell me you couldn't save the drinks until after you got home? And it's not so much that she had a drink. You got drunk before going to your child's performance, which means you drove to the school like that. What if you would have gotten into an accident? We're gonna press pause before I continue, and we're gonna look at the clip, and we'll be back to discuss it. Check this out. Let me know what you think. It was caused by a woman who appeared to be intoxicated. She provoked. Hi. Hey, I was out there crying. Go get your kids. Please go get your kids. My baby's close. Hello, sir. I'm Jamaica Levert. Hi. I'm not being given my right. So now from this clip, you can already tell that there's something going on with her. I don't know if she's had something to drink. I don't know if she's taken something or a combination of all. But you can tell from the way she's slurring and from the way she's responding that there's clearly something going on. And you're at your child's school for your child's performance in a spelling bee. And this is the way you show up to the school. But let's continue. You ready for what? Okay. Well, 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 no, I don't know. I don't know. She was not here for the present conversation, so I will not like anything yeah, she's given. Right, and yeah. I, I now want to let you know she wasn't here for this present conversation. The conversation was given that I was Point being hostile and rattled. I sat down. I got network. quiet. I waited. Williams came to me, asked me, was there a problem? I'm like, no, my baby's on stage. They're giving their presence. They're giving their performance. So now she didn't want to say what she really felt. I felt what she wanted to say. So I said what I thought her mind was saying. She was beating around the bush. I never took away from my babies. I was, that's my baby's stuff. That's my baby's spelling. I wasn't here. I wasn't here for this. I know, and I'm, I'm informing leave, you, know. and I'm informing you on what you did, Miss. We weren't in there for that conversation. Mm. We weren't. William, bro, I will walk out and I will stay out until it is all done. But what I am saying is, Miss Williams waited for me to motherfucking get hot before she said what she thought I was going to do. Okay, That's not fair. I stay cool, calm, and collected. Please let me speak. If I'm speaking, that's the only right thing is to let speak get teased. That's right. 
So here you have her exp trying to explain to the officers her point of view. She doesn't want anybody else to speak. She wants to be able to say what her position is in the situation. She doesn't want to listen to the police officers. You can tell she's slurring. You can tell she's under the influence of something. I cannot say fully what that something is, but it seems to me to be a behavior and a pattern of someone who's used to being able to get their way and say whatever they want to say without interruption, without consequence, and without accountability. These are the things that happens when you have individuals who don't know how to take accountability for any of their actions. It's always someone else's fault other than theirs. Your current behavior, your current state of mind, your current actions are someone else's fault. As she said, it's the lady's fault who tried to come to talk to her because she was trying to tell the lady what she was going to say before she said it or what she thought the lady was going to say before she said it. All while you're supposed to be supporting your child so it makes me wonder what these children have to deal with when they're at home because you don't just get in public and do things in public for the sake of being in public generally what you do in public reflects what you do in private so my question would be does she drink and behave like this in private does she have anyone in her life that holds her accountable for her actions because again, I say, to come to your child's school intoxicated or under the influence of whatever you're under the, under the influence of, you drove to the school like this with your children, because you're going to see her other daughter in a second, but you drove to the school like this with your children, but everybody else is the problem except you. Let's continue to the next clip. I will walk out and I will stay out until it is all done. But what I am saying is, this lamb's waiting for me to motherfucking get hot before she say what she thought I was going to do. That's not fair. I stay cool, calm, and collected. Please let me speak. If I'm speaking, that's the only right thing is to let speak get in team. That's right. What I'm saying is, we got, we got what you said, but we no. Okay, but she didn't say that before. She said it to Even me. this man, no, she, I said, is that what she said? No, I didn't raise my voice before. So to say again, me must, you must have been there before. So that's what you're saying. It's no, I said there. I that's didn't. What she, I know, but that's what but you're she, saying. You, what she said didn't you. know. No, you said you wasn't here before. I wasn't, so how could I'm listening you? to you. How could I'm you? Listen, so now go. you're taking we're that from me on the first floor. We're course. going out here in the hallway and away from this. Away. Thank you. I'll walk, away. walk over here. I'll walk be away. done. I walk away quiet. That's what my baby's saying. Her children done. No, they're on the stage. And I, I'll bring them out. I'll bring them out. And you get hurt while on the stage right there. Okay. Yes. I'm yeah. Well, oh, I, I, I think so. We think. Yeah. Uh, are, her, are, her, are her children like students? They are on the stage. There's well, a student who is a teenager. That's all the that's years. Years. Yeah. Okay. Um, it's just like mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. So. I let, let, them, let them finish out. Yeah. Once they're, if they win, then one, keep going until right. okay. I'll turn all three out. Yeah, that's then, cool. we'll, we'll, wait, uh, we'll take her out front. Is that cool? Yes. And then we'll you. wait for her. Yeah. And then you bring the children out. Well, I'll ones. do that. That's all I want to do to see if they're out. She oh, threatened to okay. love me. Mom did? Yes. Okay. We'll get her out. Okay. So, no, I will stand here. No. No. I will stand here. Because yeah. this one's yeah. man yeah. had me stand where I got. That's not fair. That's not fair. That's not fair. He didn't give me that. He didn't give me that. This, this man told me that. So are you saying that too? So at this point, she won't even shut up so the officers can get a word in and let her know what they need her to do or address her on what's going on. This is what I mean by accountability. This is what I mean by she's under the influence. This is what I mean by this is clearly a private behavior that is now being exhibited publicly. And this is what I say about us as a people not holding each other accountable because I'm sure this isn't a new behavior. This isn't something that she just decided to do on this day. This is just the day she happened to get caught doing it. Where are the 
individuals in her life who are going to hold her accountable for her actions, for her behavior, for her drinking, or whatever she's under the influence of. Because you don't even realize you're causing a disturbance in a school around other children who could potentially be scared. Not to mention the embarrassment that you're probably causing to your child who has to focus on a spelling bee and if y'all ever did a spelling bee in school, y'all know some of them words can be outlandish. Supercalifragilisticexpialidocious. <laughs> See, them the kind of words we had in spelling, spelling bees. But again, I say, there's no way this is isolated behavior. She won't even shut up for the police. This is someone who is entitled, who is used to getting their way, and who's not used to people telling her what to do. And this is the problem that we have in our society and that we have in our community. Because if we had people in our society and in our, our community, dear black people, then we wouldn't have so much of this behavior because other people would speak up. Are you saying that too now? Yes. 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 Tell him what she said to you about um, So she um yelled at me and almost said the um A word. Oh. And um she was like just yelling at me because like whenever I see this is one of the things that happens when you have too much alcohol you can't control your emotion you can't control your action because you're not thinking clearly your thinking is clouded and that's why I said in the other video that Aristotle in 327 B BC coined the term spirits to go along with distilled liquor because Aristotle believed that when you drink distilled liquor, you are inviting spirits into your body. So now you have to stop and assess what has control over you. And we wonder why we have children who are out of control right now. We wonder why, because children are impressionable. Children go off of what they see and what they hear. And if what they see and what they hear is this behavior, what do you think they are learning to exhibit to the rest of the world? If as a mother, this is what we are exhibiting to our children, that it's okay to be an alcoholic. It's okay to be an alcoholic in public, even in their schools, which is supposed to be a safe place. This is the behavior that we want to exhibit to them and then expect them to rise above what they see when we haven't taught them to rise above what they see. Because again, I say this is an isolated behavior. If she's doing this in public, she's doing this at home. She's doing this in other places. This is just the first time she's been caught. But this is the behavior you want to exhibit in front of your children, at your children's school, in front of other parents. And those children are going to have to deal with the after effects of your behavior. Your mother being pulled out of school by the police because she can't act right. Come on now. Now see, this is one of the things that alcohol does. Mm -hmm. You can't control your emotions. So now she's having a whole emotional outbreak saying that they set her up to be mad. Press pause for a second. Let me help y'all with something. No one should have the right, privilege, or authority to make you mad but you. This is where that emotional IQ comes in at. As long as you have triggers open for people to see the triggers, people are going to continue to push those triggers. But when you learn how to remove your triggers from anyone and society and everyone, then they can no longer push your button. But the problem is we, we wear our emotions on our sleeves. We have no control because we were never taught control. And no control with alcohol on top of it makes a recipe for disaster. Because nobody should be able to make you mad but you. And if you weren't under the influence, you should be able to control your outburst in relation to what somebody else says or does. You can't control anyone else, but you can control yourself. But you can't do that when you're under the influence. You want to be the parent that's acting up. We are our own hindrance. 
from getting where we are to the place that we want to be because we have no self-control. We have no self-control. And if we have no self-control and we're run raising younger children, how do we expect our younger generation to have something that we never taught them to have? How can you expect anything more and how can you expect anything better than what you are showing them? Which is when you don't get your way, it is okay to act out. Oh, watch her set me up to get mad. And yeah, that's crazy. Well, no, I'm the bad guy because that was me sat there playing on my mother. Tell me for a present, Chapman. Can't answer for no peace on my mouth. Mm -hmm. That's crazy. Why is he walking away? He's a perfect person to have in this conversation because he was present doing all of the information. So why should he walk away? He's getting your children. No, he needs to be present on this conversation because everything that was said was said out of a cool, calm head. Please put him present. I would not feel but I, I'm feeling prejudiced. No, I'm feeling prejudiced now because he was there to say what he said to put it in my head that I had to be hunt. So I guess the biggest concern is they're worried about kids being with their tail. No, that's not what she was worried well, about. Dear, have you taken anything? But now, now she is, right? Yeah. But, but no, Which I may I ask and I, I want to put, I want to put onto here, the recording. Here. No, wait, before, okay, was well, that not, no. What is your please, name? Sir, sir, is your sir, name? sir, 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 please let me name? ask my question. What is your name? Sir, please, what is your sir, name? please. No, stop. Was she not worried about that being a problem before? Was well, Miss we, was you Renee Williams worried about my children's safety and well-being being a problem before? Yes or no? Uh, well, it was about Yes or no? Yes. She said no before, and Here, I hope your statement happens it before. Yes. It was not yes before, because we both sat on the floor and heard her say no. She said, I didn't say you, Here, sir. What is not for never in the moment before. No, what I want to know now is Williams is now worried about the well-being of my children. She is. But she was not worried about it before. She is after she no, served No, was she before was the question, my sir. I said yes. yes. Dear, that you know she, because no, she is now. What is no, your name? No, no. What is your name so we can conduct this investigation and get you your kids and it's get you home? It's very relevant. It's very prevalent because that was not a concern what is or a question before. Was it not, sir? What is your name? Was it not, sir? Here, as a sir, police officer, sir, I'm asking you to sir, identify yourself. Sir, as a woman, I Can you go inside, please? No, yeah. Yeah. Go inside, please. That's Biz, you're just distracting her. I have no question or no answer. Okay. I'll walk home. I have no reason to answer anything if y'all let that man walk away. I can walk away just a second. All right, go ahead. So you're going to leave your kid? I, who the, who are you? Oh, you looking for bait to bite. I am not your I'm fight and I'm not question. your right. See, this is the stuff that really irritates me because we force things to escalate that don't need to be escalated. But then we want to sit back and blame everything on the police. It's the police fault. The police hate us. The police don't like us. Shut the fuck up. Because her behavior, her alcoholism, her emotional instability is what caused this issue. It had nothing to do with the police. But these are the situations that a lot of times the police have to step into. And you're getting ready to see a situation that did not have to escalate. Escalate to the point where this woman has to get arrested. Because you don't know how to get yourself under control. Because you think you know what you're talking about. While you're under the influence of whatever you're under the influence of. So let's continue. So you can see how this escalates unnecessarily. Let that man ask no questions. But how dare and proclaim and proclaim. Do you, you smell? I can't smell anything. No, I don't. I, if, if, you answer, if you just answer oh, if you would have answered, we've been great. Gravy and train. Well, we're not out here to argue. I want my daughter to come out this door. I have no I reason that. to it's, answer. It's I have no reason to answer. I have no force, no more hands to answer. Who, I'm who's your relationship with her? Me and my children walk home. Y'all can watch us walk. Are you, are you a daughter? You can watch. Okay. No, you don't answer nothing. Look, ma'am, if no, you don't... No, nothing. Nothing. Oh, my God. Look, if, you, if you don't answer, ma'am, I'm not so talking to her, I'm talking to you. All we doing our rights and our law. That's fine. Don't right. answer. Don't right. answer. So you going to take my kids from me coming out this door? What is your it, name, dear? If you don't Are answer, you yes. Are you going to take my kids yes. from me? Yes. What is your you name, cannot, dear? You cannot. You cannot legally. Step back. Step back. Step back. 
Step back. Walk that way, my daughter. Here. Walk that way. Walk that way. Don't let nothing be said. Persuade or pursue. Ma'am, you are currently being Walk. legally detained by police officers. If you do not identify yourself, you will be subject four, to arrest. Four, four, what is four, your name? Four, four, four. Please give me my reason. Please, four. Four official business pertaining to, yeah, pertaining to, what is the official business that I'm obstructing, sir? Here, what is your name? Uh, sir, I'm ask you what one is more the time. official business that I am obstructing? One more time, what is Please, your name? Please, can you not ask me that? Me being confused no, on why? You. No, you didn't. Last time, you what is your first, last date and date of birth? No, and this is under what we're going to learn. No, here, take that, take Look. that. Our well, goal isn't our goal isn't wait, to take the kids away. We just need to know who she is. She just needs anything to answer a few from questions. you. Here, take this too. Take that too. Nothing, anything on you can be touched, okay. pertain, or pursued. Go. Go. And don't. Yeah, and don't. And do not touch arrest. me. Stop. I am asking. Why are you You're asking me this? I'm arrest. asking why. You're under arrest. You're under arrest. You're not catching up. I'm not catching up. I have a detail to shoulder. Okay. Why? You, Why? You I, I'm being detained for what? Please you won't, I, you tell, me. You won't tell me. Tell me. Tell me. You won't identify yourself. I, Jamaica. Jamaica. No, it's not too late. It's not. Is it too late? It's too late. No, that's not. I, Miss Williams, already said who I was. Right, but I you all know you all got beef with me. You all got beef with me. The see that because I'm f***ing black. And oh, I'm it gets worse. <laughs> Baby, it gets worse. But press pause for a second because I need us to stop this dumb shit. I am so sick of hearing everything is because we're black. You're doing this because I'm black. You're doing that because I'm black. How about they're doing what they're doing because you're drunk? How about because you're making a spectacle of yourself in front of a school? How about because you just em embarrassed the hell out of your child who was in a spelling bee? How about you you embarrass the hell out of your teenager who's standing back watching you get arrested? How about this is happening to you because of your own fucking actions? Excuse my French YouTube, but I'm sick of this. I really am. That's why I said this woman has an issue with entitlement and no accountability. And being under the influence, you have less of your faculties to work with. But we as a people have this so bad. The police, the police, the police. Maybe if you act right, you wouldn't have to deal with the police. If you didn't show up to your child's school intoxicated, you wouldn't be dealing with the police now. You'd be sitting inside of the school enjoying your child's spelling bee. Instead, you're outside being led into a police car in front of your child. So everybody at the school got to see your behavior and how you're acting. Come on, y'all. At what point are we going to do better? I don't have a problem with you not liking the police. If you don't like them that much, then you wouldn't do stuff in order to see them. How about that? But no, that's too real for some of y'all. Because we'd prefer to sit back and play the damn victim instead of taking accountability for our actions and doing damn better. That's the problem I have with this. Let's continue. Do you have any pockets or anything like that? I gave myself my name. I'm being detained yeah, because I gave my name. Sir, sir, sir. Can I speak to you your face? Please stop hearing your, your side of my head. Okay, you please stop hearing your side of my head. Can I please? You can, 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 can I? You did. Can I please speak to the gentleman right there at the door? Can I please speak to him? Sir, I was not given my rights. I've not been Miranda rights. And I've not been given none of my mom. Because all I said was, right, what here. did I do wrong? I'm going to tell you one more no, time. No, get up. Put your feet inside man. the car. I will Mirandarize me. Nope. Mirandarize me first. Mirandarize me first. Sir, sir, sir. Sir, please, sir. Sir, please. Sir, you know it's wrong. Sir, you know it's wrong. Sir, please. That's not fucking fair. <laughs> yep. You won't entertain a conversation. She just wants to talk over you. Yeah. Right. She'll get super, super, super amped up. Like, yeah. yeah. How many kids did you get? Three. 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 Yeah. Three. Yeah. Yeah. Three. 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 Three.
No. Why are you? Why are you? Why are you? Why are you, are you the arresting right to remain me? Silent. No. Why are you arresting me? Obstruction of for official what? business. For what? For what official business? For the official business we are conducting. Of what name? Station. My name. My name is That's official right. business. That was part no, of please it. say it on the camera. Say it on. Is it because I didn't camera. get my name? Ma'am, would you like to? No, my name. Would you like is to that why? Is that why? Right? Yes or no? Any yes, yes, or, yes okay. please. Yes. All right, you have no, the right. I'm asking a question. You have the right to remain <laughs> silent. Anything you say. All right, dear, I'm not going to speak to you because you will not acknowledge your Miranda rights or allow me to read please, them. Please, sir, read me my rights. Please, sir. Okay. Please, sir. You're gonna but I be, ask nope, you, you're have to be my official, you for official stop, business. Stop. All right, we're not doing No, this. I'm asking. No, I'm my wrong for asking why. Why am I wrong for asking why? All right, dear, window's going up because you keep screaming. Don't worry, though, I have the uh, AC on full low. Max AC is on. Let me blow this up so y'all can see her acting a damn fool. What baby? What baby? You have to tell me you won't be arrested. That's not fair. That's not fair. What made me see me? Please give me a warning. I swear to God, I let go. Give me a warning, please. Please give me a warning. Please, I walk away. I walk away and I'll not say nothing. Please give me a warning. My baby Steve. Please give me a warning, sir. Please, God. Please, God, give me a warning. I swear to God, I'll shut up. I'll shut up and I'll shut the f up. Please give me Please give me a warning. I wasn't even giving a warning. I wasn't even giving a warning. I didn't even get a warning. Stop reading my Miranda. If I just oh God. Please let me go to my babies. I'll shut up. Please, I'll shut up, please. Please give me a warning. Oh, my baby. What is your social security number? But can I ask that? What is your social security number? Can I ask that, sir? Am I still going to jail regardless? Please, is that wrong to me to ask, sir? Yes, you are 110% going to jail today. Now, what is your social security number? You still need to identify yourself. You'll be entered in as J. Doe. You already arrested me. Why do I need to You want, you, want, you want your siblings, correct? So now you want a warning, right? You was tough just a few minutes ago, though, right? You was just nothing can partake, pertain, or persuade Ebonics with your duck ass. And now you snotting and crying and throwing a whole tantrum in front of the school so everybody can hear how the hell you are acting because you can't control your damn liquor. But mama always said, you want to know who a person truly is? Get them drunk or mad because this is who you are on this day their day your day god's day probably work day this is how you act and i feel sorry for her children i do because if they don't choose different they will think this is the behavior you exhibit when you don't get your damn way your children are going to see this they're old enough your children's friends are going to see this the school bullies are going to see this they're going to see you on Beyonce's Enter of the Net and China's World Wide Web acting a damn fool because your dumb ass think you know your rights. How about exercising your right to remain damn silent? 
How about that? But it don't end here. You didn't give me a warning. Why should someone have to warn you not to put your kids in jeopardy as a mother? But see, these are the women that y'all pipe down and plug up when your pecker get on wood. And you don't stop to think about, if I plug her with my seed, will she be a nurturer, protector, guide? What are her morals? life outlook what will she teach your children see y'all don't think about stuff like that you don't and this is what your children will have to deal with this is the example that's set in front of them this is what they're learning and now that she's dealing with someone the police who's gonna hold her ass accountable and you can't just talk your way out of it now you want to have a damn tantrum but protect black women how about black women act right how about that how about black women exhibit an example in front of your kids how about that how about black women showing yourself in a light that can be respectable how about that but no we don't like that talk because somehow we're in a day and age where we feel like just because we're black women we should be able to do and say whatever the hell we want to without consequence we got to do better. You want, you want you want your siblings, correct? <laughs> you look look at me. Okay? You you have to help me out. All right? This was not our goal. Where does your aunt live? What? Where does your aunt live? She lives down on. Do you know the address? No, I don't know. I don't know my baby. I don't know my baby, sir. I don't want to. Is is your dad the same same father for your two siblings? Right, right. No, he's my stepfather. He's your stepfather? Yes. Is he the father of the two? No. Okay. okay. <laughs> so real daddy in jail. Mama finna go to jail. This what these kids have to deal with. I want y'all to see this. We so smart though. Was she drinking? Yes. She was so, you, you, with her boyfriend. Is that the boyfriend that's your stepdad? Yes. Okay. And she was getting into it with them. But, and she so took what? a few drinks before we came because we just wanted to cook in this stuff. She only got loud because the principal kept coming right, up to her right and like getting on her face and pressing her. And like trying to put her to calm down and then the principal. And herein lies the problem. Now you have your child trying to justify your actions and behavior. See what I mean? No accountability. And this is what she's teaching her children. That everything is everybody else's fault and not your own. So because someone is telling you to calm down, because you're clearly under the influence, that it's okay because you don't like what's being said to you. So now you have this baby sitting out here crying because she has to watch her mother get arrested for acting a damn fool in public. And you got your baby out here trying to justify your damn action because you don't know how to be a responsible being in society. And somehow we don't see a problem with it because I'm sure someone is going to say, this is the police's fault. Shut up. 
The police are not responsible for your actions. You are. At some point, if we want better for our children, we have to exhibit better in front of them. Period. Point blank. We teach our children that you can be anything that you want to be. But a victim shouldn't be one of them. Especially a victim of our own circumstance. Especially a victim of our own trash ass behavior. Do you do you understand why we're where we're at right now? All we needed was a little bit of cooperation from your mother. And we would have been we could have been done by now. But the concern is if she has been drinking and she gets in the drive with the little children, then that puts the children at risk too. So we, we can't we can't just let that happen. Okay? Please unlike it or stay on it. Unlock what? Ventilation. Ventilation. You just said no. And you just said a picture to obstruct your business. It was no friendships. It was no fugitives. It was no my fing. Here's the idea. I will roll down the window. Sir, I'm sorry you bleed. Because it's because I'm talking over you, not because That's correct. Because of my right. So not because of my right, because I'm I'm bothering you. Please put that on there. That's not obstruction. That's my complicated conference and confidential. Please. Why did you open the door? I just said I was wrong. I just said I was wrong. What? <laughs> Look, you guys are gonna be all right, all right? Your mom made a mistake today, that's it. Hey, I got a place for him if, you, if we need. So my whole goal was to do just a uh, custody exchange, call CSP referral, and then do what we have to do with her. Are you cool with your stepdad? Okay, is that, that's a viable option? See, this is the stuff that diminishes and tarnishes what happened to George Floyd. Because now, for some reason, everybody is screaming, No, your actions are trying to kill you. The air is on high. You're sitting in the back of the police car where you should be for your behavior. And because you're under the influence and can't control your emotions, you're exerting more energy than you need to. And that's why you're hot. It don't have nothing to do with them. This all has to do with you. But see, the problem is, we know that all we gotta do is start screaming this dumb shit. And here come the black people with the phones out recording. I'm so glad that they started releasing body cam footage. Not just for our protection. Because some of us need it. Because there are some dirty cops. However, I'm glad they released it for a lot of their protection. Because just like there's dirty cops, there's good ones too. And I applaud these police for handling this situation. With as much patience as they did. Because ain't no way in hell I could ride to a police station with all this going on in the back of my car. No way in hell. But it don't stop here. You would think this will be the end of it. No, let's continue. An adult here to pick you guys up. Okay. Are, I'll let you talk to her, but you got to remember, like, we still have our job aspect to do too, okay? All right, come on. Please, hey, talk, talk to your daughter. Sir, please. Talk to your, talk, talk to your, talk to your daughter. I gotta throw up. I'm not doing it though. He just asked me to come out. He just asked me. He just asked me. Talk, me down talk to your daughter. I just told my daughter. He just asked me, you know, I want my daughter to go to CPS. Okay, dear. Oh, Your options are CSP or you give consent for them to go I with step down. I gotta throw out. I gotta throw You have to answer these questions. I gotta throw out. I gotta throw out. Do you consent to them I going with step down? I gotta throw out, sir. Please, you throw out. Yes, you do. Can you say that one more time for IBWC, <laughs> that you consent for the children to go to the custody of the, their stepfather? She she consented. It's on the back camera. I'm gonna move her away from the school. The officers contacted the stepfather and stayed with the children until he arrived. Although CPS did not need to intervene, the woman's behavior continued to be problematic. All right, dear, we're gonna walk to the back of the wagon, all right? And then the officer's gonna take custody of you. 
Alrighty. Don't touch me. I know how to step out of the door. Right. Step back. Go ahead. Step back. Step back. Where Here. the go go? Just step out. Step back, please. For my own comfort. Step. My own comfort. May you please step back. I can't. Me speaking of my rights as a human being, not being. Would seen. you feel better if it's other officers? I here? ask you to step back. There we go. I, and thank you, sir. Don't step too close. Thank you. You step back, huh? But he won't step back. He got me sitting here looking like a dog. And I asked for my rights, and he read my rights. He ain't even read me my rights still. But well, ma'am, 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 so reading my rights, Miranda only works if we're, if we're If you're if being we're questioning, detained. No, if we're questioning. Uh, if you're, yeah, if and I was arrested. already detained before I was Miranda rights. Right, I know. Right, right, I know. Okay. He Miranda rights me, okay. and he lied about his name. Okay. He lied about his name. Well, well ma'am, we got to go, ma'am. Sir, and I cannot please get some tissue to clear my fucking face I don't, I don't face have any up. tissue, ma'am. If I had tissue, I'd definitely give it to you. Okay, I totally understand. Sure. I do it for myself. I have PTSD. I have anxiety. I have associated disorder. And I take a Mepresol. And I take medication. Okay. I take medication for my shit. Nobody asks me about this. But I do take these things. And I feel it's important to declare these things before I was detained and I wasn't okay. the same. <laughs> Well, ma'am, I'm here to transport you, okay, to the county, all right? So you just step on out. Come with me. All right? Where am I being Where am I being detained, sir? You're, you're no longer, you're, you're arrested. You're Why being am I being detained? Ma'am, I have no idea. Didn't ask the officer. No, but you said it was for a reason. What did I do? Bro? No, I said for, to question you. And I gave answer. I wasn't questioned, sir. Okay. I wasn't questioned. I gave my name at the door. So right why am I being questioned for? Point. I don't what know what happened. Man, you're asking the person to take me the My on the person is to transport you. Okay? Well, why am I being transported if I didn't break the law, sir? Please. There's nothing I can tell you about that. I have no idea. He, Come on, man, let's go. Ask him. Can he He's standing right too? there. Mm -hmm. I'm Ask him. Him. Why am I being You're under detained? arrest for obstruction of official business. And what official business, sir? Clear to disclose personal information. I gave my name at the door. And disorderly conduct. Oh, disorderly conduct under what obstruct? I told under what I'm struck. Let's go. Uh, no, please ask him to he just state it. it you to know you. he did not. He said disorderly conduct, but he did not display. He did not explain what disorderly conduct. I right gave my order. name, that's, sir. That's am I wrong for asking? You are that, transporting listen, listen, me, listen, listen, sir. Listen. Sir, You're ask him. Am I wrong? Yes, you are. Answer. Yes, you are. Answering. I'm so wrong. Come on, man. Let's go. Let's go. On. Come on. Let's go. Ma'am, let's go. Ma'am, we don't want to have to pull you out of the back of that car. We're you trying to do this. You will not never have this. to do that. Okay, well, please, step like out. No, we don't want to do that, I've so come on, ma'am. Like let's a dog, let's step on out. Let's step on out, ma'am. Let's I go. I will step and I listen, will listen, walk. Listen, I am stepping and I am walking. If I'm you're stepping and I'm walking. You're turning a misdemeanor into a felony, okay? We're trying to oh, avoid that. Oh, so but go. I don't even know what the misdemeanor is. He just and explained I ain't it been, to you. No, he did not. He just told you what they were. Because he did not. Okay, did he? Yes, he just did. Please explain again, Markham. No, nope. he just told we're you. Done. No, he did it. Let's go. No, he did it. We'll wind the video tape later, okay? Let's go. Oh. It's all recorded, okay? Come on. Yes, sir. It must be cute being a motherfucker. No, 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 we're going this way. Not do not, not, do not. Please don't do this. Uh, do what? Be a black woman? Mm -hmm. Excuse me. Excuse me. I hope you hold your roots true. Stop. Listen, I, what do I look gonna, back? Gonna, but look back. Door. What do I do? <laughs> I got anxiety. I got, I got. Well, relax. Uh, no, 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 no. No, I got it. <laughs> I just said I got these things. And I let this guy get put me in these things. Put him in the car. Get him away from me. Please get him he, he is here to make sure no, he is not. No, he is not. I'm right down now. the street. I will sit down and I'll wait for him to walk away. I will get I, this car. I will get this car. Go away. He Go away, that. Satan. Go away. Thank you. Go away! I will get in this car when this have, we walk have away. Man, we have Wait, to I'm detained under you, right? Under you, cars. walk away, please. Does he cars. have to be here? Yes. Just no, and then yes. and no, he don't. We have to How? Under cars. what law? I'll bring your kids back later.
Okay. Here, here, matter of fact, here. Go. No, you, you ain't gotta worry about go. it. Go, then go. Yeah, then it. go. Got He'll got get him. You got another All set. Right. Go. Right. And he's still waiting for that gratification. Go. I'm on the devil working on me. I'm blessing him. Favorite. I'll step in my motherfucking shit. Is he gone? Yeah. No, he's not in his car yet. Why would you lie to me? Come step here. He's gone. Why would you lie to me? Listen, man. Come here. Come here. Come here. Look. Look. Okay. I'm in the car. Don't touch me. I'm doing my shit. Okay. Make sure he gets there. He's gone. 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 He's Don't touch me. I will get this car. I will get this car with me. Let me just know. I'll step back to my train. Maybe when I'm home. I'll show you that, man. Maybe you know you did. Yeah, I'm going to say that. Listen, he was on this I'm, side. I, that's the street. I want to step Listen, on this side, please. I know, please but that's, that's the street. We can't. That's the street. No that's the street. I can't take the chance. He's gone. He's he was in standing over car. here. He, he was gone. Car. He's not right. gone. He's not gone. He can't leave. Until I get you loaded up. No, he don't. You cannot leave until I get you loaded up. No, no it's not. Because you cannot leave without my shoulder. It is how it works. Work. Okay, well, 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 I'll tell you what, ma'am. You can write to the Congress. You can write to the mayor. I don't need to write to nobody. I'm writing to my higher power. Listen, then you can write to God. I'm writing to God. Okay, and you can write to him as well. I'm writing to God. God can't you know I know. But until then, they can't do Can that. I please sit down? Can you have a cigarette? You I have, have a cigarette. We don't smoke. You know, I, you, you saying we don't smoke mm -hmm. like that's something. I've, I've sat with fucking cops. Okay, well, I don't smoke. You okay? They don't say we. You well, and your I'm pretty own sure man. she doesn't smoke. Okay, you saying we like y'all an entity and a being. You well, are you. I'm pretty sure he doesn't smoke. I don't I, smoke I, I, Can well, I have, you a have, a have a cigarette? I'll for you. You, I ask you. Ma'am, I don't have a cigarette. All right, then, so I say we. Because the officer's sitting over there and I can yell for him to give me a cigarette. Uh, he already said right, no. Well, ma'am, well, all right, well, then we almost can't told we you no. Can we please wait till you go? I can't. Okay. Because he can't leave the scene until I leave the scene. And that's false. Okay, well, ma'am, when did you give me back the back? Is that true or not? Am I wrong? I'm not, you are that? wrong, and I'm not lying to you, okay? And he can't read leave the until ordinance I leave. In the, read the ordinance in the There's court. There's a policy procedure for that. Read the ordinance. There's no I ordinance. Need the ordinance. I need the ordinance in the code. Well, you can make it up. Please, make it, no, I'm not making up nothing. I'm not, I'm not. I need your ordinance. Because he is with me. And I need your ordinance in your code. He is with I me. I need your ordinance. Leave. I need your ordinance. Okay, well, well this Number is the Number one, what? I don't know. Make it no, up. No, you but do. He can't I don't leave. need to make up. I'm shit. not looking up nothing. I up know. For you. No, he but, but that's why he can't done. leave. So, what is it that makes him not be able to leave? Man, you're making this a lot longer. It's got to be. All I'm asking you for ordinance in the code, so I can you're write it down. You're making this a lot longer. Okay, what pen and paper you got? Why do I need pen and paper? You're writing for it down. Uh, who say my mind ain't more inclined? You know, okay, it's got okay. a boogie. It probably must be, be good. real ugly. No, nah, my shit dripping and looking nasty, and okay. I never well, let listen. nobody sit there. I asked we for the ordinance go. and the code. We please, have to sir. go. Ordinance and code. We have to ordinance go. Ordinance and code, please. Well, there, well, I'll tell you what. Sir, please don't be rough with me and just give me an ordinance and code. We're not going to be playing the game. Oh. I need you to get me back in this wagon. Oh. I got this out. You're not giving. Thank you. It didn't end there. Let's come on out. You gotta, you gotta come out. Okay.
Yes or no? Excuse me, I don't need that now. Ma'am, what was your question? <laughs> Too many allergies. I have penicillin in my ceiling. Any major medical conditions? I have PTSD, I have an associated disorder, and I have bipolar disorder. Are you suicidal or homicidal? No. Any broken bones? I have a dislocated joint in my left shoulder that wasn't taken into consideration before, so I don't think it needs much time. Thank you. Thank you. Alright, so you've never been here before, right? So she asked you no question. Is this how it's gonna go? Yes, no? Man, it's still even being to be out and submit the original charges. We don't need to add anything I extra. Ask you for anything. I know you didn't ask me anything, but we're trying to make this easier. I've been here before. How am I supposed to know that? I've been here before. The bike you before. I didn't say you've been here before. You said people bite you. Okay. And I said I wanted so, to know what the bite you. Do we want to start over? I'll start I will. No. You don't want to start over? No, it's to ask me a question. Thank so, you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. So, Zero. I Thank you. Alright, so. Well, I was going to explain to you what's going to happen. I'm going to patch you down and take the handcuffs off when you all your jewelry out. Okay? So, face that wall for me. I'm going to ask you the same question I ask every single person. Mm -hmm. Huh? Anything on that's going to focus on me? No. Man, I said what I said. This is absolutely despicable, disgusting, degrading, embarrassing, and damn trifling. This is why I say in the beginning of my Hennessy Zone videos that we think and drink responsibly. If you don't have the capacity or the ability to think responsibly when you drink, then maybe you shouldn't drink. It's not for everybody. And this is why. Because some of y'all lose y'all damn mind when y'all drink. Drop in the comments and let me know what you think about this. Consider joining the channel. Becoming a member of the Champagne Gang. The Fizz Fam. Become a confidant. Hit that like and subscribe button so you'll be notified when we jump into wherever we jump into for another show. Thank you for joining us for another episode of Hennessy Zone. Straight talk. No chaser. <laughs> Until next time. See you soon.